Hi, my name's DeAndrea. I'm here at the gravesite of my grandmother. My grandmother was the most important person in my life. She was not just the grandmother. My grandmother was my mother. She was my mentor. She was a genius. She did a fabulous job with her four sons. She, the, all four of them are very successful because of her genius and parenting skills and love and admiration of her children. I came last year to visit my grandmother at her graveside and I couldn't find her. I searched and I searched and I searched. It was raining, I was getting wet. I couldn't find her. So I came back to the cemetery, which is quite a trip for me. You have to take a bus to the train and then from the train another bus and then you have to walk quite a bit. And I, but I came back, of course, because as I said, my grandmother was the most important person and still is. Even though she's passed away, there's not a day that goes by that I don't think about her. So the second time I came to the cemetery, I had the assistance of two gentlemen who work for the cemetery. They couldn't find her. They searched and searched and searched. And then after about an hour or so, one of the two men figured it out. He said, you know, your grandmother is over here. He pointed to an empty spot. He said, nobody ever got a stone for her. So even though I have absolutely no money, I am so broke. I paid for the excavation and I paid for the stone. And I did this because the gift of sacrifice is the tr truest gift of love. If you could afford it, and it, it, it means nothing to you, that's not as much of a gift that I gave her. I wish I could have given her more. I wish I could have her back in my life. And I'm sure she is. I'm sure she's one of the angels in my life. But this is what I did for my grandma. And I'm so happy when I came here. The stone is beautiful. And it's for both my grandmother and my grandfather. They were buried together.